it up and down the court. Support each other. Yep. If somebody misses an assignment, switch, talk. All right? Don't yell at each other. Stay with each other. Encourage right? each Stay other. Stay with yeah. each other. Encourage each other. Switch, talk. Remember, it's not going to matter if you switch. All right? Let's go. Let's go, y'all. Let's go, ladies! First of all, I want to um, congratulate Maris. They, they really fought hard tonight, and they're a very, very good team. They're an excellent um, three-point shooting team, and they have really good players, and I just thought it was a really hard-fought battle tonight. Um, I felt like we started the game very, very strong on the defensive end, and we just couldn't get a shot to fall in the, uh, on the offensive end. We got good shots. We just couldn't get anything to fall. And I think a lot of that's due to the fact that you know, we've been off for such a long time that we couldn't get any rhythm. And so once our shots stopped falling, we started to take bad shots. And once you start taking bad shots, even though you're playing good defense, it puts you in a hole. And that's what happened. We got down by six at halftime, five or six by, at halftime. And um, I felt like if we would just get ourselves into a little faster pace and play a little harder on the offensive end, that we would um, definitely have a better chance. And that was when. Um, uh, Monica Wright and Linda Littles started to change the um, complexion of the game along with Ariana Moore in terms of pushing the ball and getting it up and down the court. And then Aisha and uh, Kelly Hardig started setting quick screens and it was able to free us up to get us into the lane where we had easier shots. Um, we were able to break open a little bit and get some fast break points and that really helped us to get started. Once we loosened up, um, we started to hit shots. We started to hit threes and everything else. So. Uh, I felt like we were on our way once that happened. I thought Ari had a tremendous game tonight. Um, I, I thought that she stayed within herself. Sometimes when, when Ari gets out there, she gets a little bit outside of what we want her to do, but she stayed well within what I wanted her to do tonight. She played like a point guard. Um, she was able to find people out there, assist people, um, do a, did a very good job at the free throw line down the stretch. And I was just really proud of her performance. I think she played very good defense tonight. I, I, don't, I really don't have anything um, negative to say about her. I thought that she just did a, a really great job stepping in and playing that many minutes because I really played her probably more minutes than she's ever played here um, in one game. And um, she did ask me a couple of times if she could get a breather. So one time I said no. <laughs> so. So, I mean, she really did a great job and stepped up. And, you know, she's been working very hard and she's been getting to this point. It's just taken us a while to get here, to get the philosophy, to get the understanding of what I need and what I want. And so now she's really picked it up and did a great job. I thought both, uh, both of them, and I, and I called on Brittany Edwards tonight, um, might have surprised her a little bit, but um, it was a little shorter bench when Kelly got into foul trouble right away, you know, in the first minute of the game. I had to um, lengthen my ben bench a little bit, and uh, Brittany did a really good job when she went in of just being very steady. Um, she did a really good job of, of guarding the players she had to guard and just and, st and stuck the ball in the basket, and she just knows, Brittany knows how to play. Um, Whitney has been a player that's played a lot of minutes for me, and um, she's done. She did a great job tonight. She really did. Uh, a couple times she missed people on assignments on defense, but for the most part, I thought she played a very good offensive game. And she's a very steady player. She's a steady Eddie, so I never have a problem putting her in the game.